There are discoveries in astronomy that bring comfort, nebulae of beauty, the emergence of stars, and faraway galaxies that remind us of how vast and incredible the universe truly is. However, there are discoveries that achieve the opposite result, that penetrate our sense of safety and remind us that space is not just beautiful. It is hostile, unpredictable, and occasionally terrifying. That is exactly what has transpired recently. Humanity's James Webb Space Telescope, the most powerful eye on the cosmos, has detected something racing toward our solar system from the void beyond the heliopause. This isn't an asteroid, neither a comet born in the frozen Oort cloud nor our asteroid belt. This is, in fact, an interstellar object, something that has traveled unfathomable distances through the dark, cold ocean between stars. And the web has, for the first time, captured its specifics with terrifying clarity. Scientists are calling it 3 Atlas. Although it is moving at breakneck speed, it is also acting in ways unlike any other comet should. Its peculiar brightness, massive scale, and incomprehensible age are compelling researchers to question whether this is merely a frozen relic of another star system or something much more mysterious. This evening, we delve deeply into what the web has revealed about this object and its purpose. Astronomers are captivated and uneasy about what it might bring to humanity. On July 1st, the story began quietly. During this year's Atlas Survey Telescope in Rio Hurtado, Chile, it was conducting its routine sweep of the skies. Intended to detect near-Earth objects, Atlas has captured thousands of asteroids in the past. But that night, its instruments picked up something unusual, a thing that moves faster than anything else frequently seen, a faint speck streaking against the plane of the galaxy. At first, it was cataloged as just another comet candidate. But in a matter of hours, analysis revealed something extraordinary. Its orbit was hyperbolic, meaning it did not originate from our solar system. This was no local wanderer. The traveler was from the stars. As information poured in from various observatories all over the world, astronomers confirmed that this was only the third known interstellar object ever detected after Oumuamua in 2017 and Borisov in 2019. They named it Three Atlas. But in contrast to the others, this new visitor differed in a crucial way, its speed. Traveling at 58 kilometers per second, which is almost twice as fast as Borisov and far quicker than Aumuamua, it shattered expectations. It was as if it had been thrown through space with much more force than anything we comprehended. And with each passing night, its trajectory made one thing clear. It was immediately entering the fundamental unit of our solar system. When the web's instruments were finally trained on 3E Atlas, the results stunned astronomers. They had expected the grainy blur of a frozen rock surrounded by a coma of dust and ice. Instead, the web captured something far brighter, larger, and more complex. The nucleus of 3E Atlas was estimated to be nearly 10 kilometers across, making it far larger than its predecessors. It was surrounded by a coma, a cloud of gas and dust, but what unnerved scientists was its sheer brightness. It was the most brilliant interstellar object ever recorded, shining with a brightness that suggested powerful activity within. Then came the particulars that shook them even further. It rotated in an unusual manner, stable for approximately 29 hours. However, its brightness remained unchanged, implying a smoother, more uniform surface than anticipated for a comet of this size. Where Borisov shed vast dust and gas plumes, three atlases seemed restrained, almost controlled, radiating only enough to keep its halo while keeping its form intact. Its light curve showed very little variation, it felt artificial due to the consistency. And as the web discovered after analyzing its spectrum, chemical signatures redder than even D-type asteroids hinted at otherworldly origins unlike any other in our solar system's history. To astronomers used to the chaos of comets, this was to orderly, to deliberate. It raised a chilling question, was this truly a natural object or were we staring at something designed? If 3E Atlas is natural, it is also very old, almost impossibly so. 
Using its velocity as a clue, astronomers thought it might be between 3 and 11 billion years old. To put that into perspective, it might have formed before our sun even existed, a relic from a star system that has long since died. This staggering age means that 3E Atlas might be carrying materials from an era of the universe that is no longer there. Matter formed by processes that are out of our galaxy right now. However, this only increased the mystery. How could an object survive billions of years of traveling across the stars without separating or deteriorating? Cosmic impacts, micrometeorites, radiation, and the utter lack of anything in deep space should have worn it down to nothing. Yet, here it was, intact, massive, and bright. Several scientists hypothesized that its structure must be extremely dense, made of exotic materials and ices hardened under pressures that were unimaginable. Others suggested it could be a fragment of a destroyed planet, ejected violently into space and set on a course that would eventually bring it here. But now came the theories that unsettled everyone. What if its durability, its smoothness, its strange stability were not natural at all? What if it were constructed this way? A construct designed to survive billions of years, silently crossing star systems until it found us. Perhaps the most unnerving aspect of 3E Atlas is its travel through the solar system. Based on calculations, it will reach its closest point to the Sun on October 30th, passing just inside the orbit of Mars before being flung back into interstellar space. But unlike other interstellar comets, its trajectory has raised eyebrows. Its orbit does not appear random. How it threads through gravitational influences, the precision with which it bypasses Earth while still offering us a clear view seems to precise. Some astronomers argue this is nothing more than celestial mechanics playing out on a vast scale. However, others secretly admit that its course looks suspiciously like navigation as if its method of travel was intended to be seen, intended for study, but never intended to meet. If that's the case, therefore, 3 IE Atlas is not merely a traveler. It's a messenger placed on a path to coincide precisely with our gaze when the human race had the means to see it. The purpose of the James Webb Telescope was to delve into the beginning of time. But possibly, it might have been destined to capture this object precisely at this very moment. And if that's the case, then the question becomes frighteningly obvious, who did send it? Why is this? As the internet continued to monitor 3 IE Atlas, one of the most puzzling discoveries came not from its visible form, but from its energy profile. Asteroids and natural comets produce heat haphazardly, emitting gases as their ice is broken up by the sun's rays on their surfaces. But 3 IE Atlas did not behave in this way. Instead, it appeared to control its heat output, giving off energy in rhythmic intervals that resembled almost a heartbeat. Data from infrared showed that these pulses were not accidental. They repeated in sequences that mirrored mathematicians' constants, like prime numbers and ratios in line with Fibonacci sequences. At first, to ignore this as coincidence was possible, but the statistical analysis grew as the data grew. Probability became so difficult to ignore. Was this just a peculiarity of unusual chemistry, or was this an indication deliberately encoded into the very way the object interacted with sunlight? For some astronomers, this marked the turning point. A comet from nature does not communicate. Nevertheless, the patterns of 3 IE Atlas were beginning to seem less like physics and more like intention. More was revealed by high-resolution images, showing troubling aspects of the structure of 3 IE Atlas. While the majority of comets are erratic, irregular, and jagged in their rotation, this object's surface was unnervingly smooth and uniform. Its light curve, usually a chaotic flicker in natural objects, remained constant over long observations, suggesting a surface without significant variation. Even stranger, certain aspects appeared angular, with regions of flatness that reflected light in rapid spurts. Some observers described it as crystalline, others as metallic, but everyone agreed that it lacked the randomness expected of something shaped purely through gravity and collisions. 
The James Webb Telescope even identified some angular reflections that gave the impression of panel structures, as though its outer shell was segmented. This likeness to design rather than geology fueled speculation that 3 IE Atlas was much more than just a rock drifting through space, but perhaps a construct, something engineered to survive the brutal emptiness of the interstellar medium for billions of years. Additionally, if its shape was deliberate, then its survival was not luck it was by design. In the beginning, discovery and news regarding 3 IE Atlas swung freely throughout the scientific community. Data from the James Webb Telescope, ground-based observatories, and space agencies circulated openly, and researchers across the globe collaborated to decode its complexities. But as additional evidence piled up suggesting that this object was anything other than typical, that openness began to fade. Reports were suddenly delayed. Data streams went dark. And researchers who once gave interviews stopped responding to inquiries. Leaks from within institutions hinted at classified meetings that took place between governments, defense organizations, and space agencies. Several sources asserted that the object's unusual signals were to deliberate to be ignored, while others offered hints regarding discussions of potential risks. What if 3 IE Atlas wasn't just a relic, but an active probe capable of observation or even more? The agencies reassured the world publicly that everything was under control. But behind the curtain, urgency was rising. Elon Musk himself cryptically tweeted that the universe has just grown in size, a comment that many interpreted as a subtle acknowledgement that even private space companies were being drawn into the growing web of secrecy. What unsettles scientists most about 3 IE Atlas is not only its presence, but where it's going. Calculations show that, following its close proximity to the Sun, instead of continuing on a straightforward hyperbolic path into deep space, its trajectory will shift slightly, bending into a route that moves it toward the stars in outer space in a way no natural comet should. Some predict it will pass close to Saturn before disappearing into the void, while others suggest that its course may be deliberately aligned to rendezvous with something hidden beyond the Cooper Belt. The possibility that this object is navigating has sparked endless discussion. If it truly has a programmed course, then what awaits at its final destination? A system of similar probes, a larger construct stationed at the edge of our system, or something else entirely, watching from the cold dark. Whatever the truth, the unsettling fact persists, this thing is not by chance. It is not a mess. It moves with purpose and that purpose has yet to show itself. 3 IE Atlas was supposed to be an ephemeral visitor from outer space, a frozen relic that moves aimlessly about the galaxy. However, the James Webb Space Telescope has seen something that no telescope has ever seen something too easy to dismiss. It's a natural brightness, its smooth, angular surfaces, its pulsating energy in a rhythm, its carefully plotted course through our solar system each component points to the same terrifying possibility. This object is not behaving like a comet. It is behaving like a machine. And if it is a machine, then somewhere, someone or something built it, sent it, and allowed it to cross the gulf of space until it reached us. Whether it is here to observe, to test, or to send a message, humanity's readiness remains hidden in its silence. However, silence may be the loudest answer of all. Maybe it is waiting to see if we recognize it for what it truly is. Perhaps it has been here previously, going unnoticed when our instruments were too primitive to detect it. Or perhaps its mission is only now beginning, and what we've seen so far is only the first move. Whatever the truth, there is one certainty. The James Webb Telescope hasn't just shown us a comet. It has shown us a mirror that reflects our greatest anxiety. We have company, and what follows will define the future of our species.